in the hall. What? Hey, right. Well, look at you. Yeah, you too. How about that? Yeah, right. <laughs> long time. Yeah, it's been a long time. I didn't know you long. No, right. I usually, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Me too. And like, you know, when I'm in the city. <clears throat> yeah, you know, it's, uh, it's convenient. Yeah, convenient. Yeah. yeah. So how you been? Fine. Fine, and you? Good. I'm good. Good. No, I'm good. Really good. Oh, that's, uh, that's swell. Never been better. All right, well, let's get the hit. <coughs> it's you. Me? Well, you know, it's all so getting by. How's that? Well, you know, up and down, good times, bad times. Mm -hmm. Works like that sometimes. Yes, it does. Me, though, I got to say right now, things are on me up and up. Couldn't be better, in fact. Well, that's good to hear. <laughs> nah, things have been going pretty good for me since, you know. Yeah, well, that's how it should be. You're looking well. Me? Yeah. Ah. Well, it's been a good few years. Nah, you're looking really well, considering. Oh, yeah, <laughs> considering. It has. It has been a good few years. Yes, it has. Yeah, and here we are. Yep, here we are. It's funny we've never arrived. No, oh, right. Well, you know, I only come here. Well, I'm me too, me too. I come here like once a month, once every couple of months. Same here, you know, every sometimes it's two weeks. Same here, you know, it depends on the eyes. Same here, same here, same here. Because it must be what? <laughs> right. You know, since we last. Since what? Since we last, since, you it's know. It's been a good few years. Yeah, since all that. All that? That business. That business? <laughs> yeah, that business, since all that. Oh, uh, that, that business. business. Yeah. yeah. That business. That was a bad business? Yes, it was. <laughs> Pretty bad. Yeah, well, you know, shit happens. It does? There was a lot of shit went down back then. Yeah, well, it's a long time ago. Even so, it was some pretty bad shit. Yeah, still. <laughs> you are. Still think about it? No. I let it go. Let it go a long time ago. You gotta let it go. That's what I done, I let it go. <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, you'd just be dwelling on it. Yeah, well, I don't dwell on it. Not anymore. I mean, uh, you know, I kind of just go with the flow. You know, I just go wherever the flow takes me. Yeah, you gotta move on. That's what I've done. I've moved on. Good. <laughs> Glad to hear it. Glad to know you bear no ill will. Why should I bear anybody any ill will? It's possible. You might, you know. Life's too short. It is. Life's too short to dwell on what might or might not have been. Yeah, well, you see, I, I like to just live my life as it is now. You know, concentrate on the here and the now. I don't look back. No, it's no use in it, is it? So, uh, you still see any of the old crowd? No. No, me neither. No, I, uh, I moved on the other side of town. You did? Yeah, a good few years now. What, box? Oh, it's way out in the sticks. It's a small apartment. I don't go into the old neighborhood. I don't get out much myself. You know how it is. Sure. Most of the old crowd seem to have uh, slipped away. And yeah, well, that's how it is. Things happen. People change, people move on, move away. That's right. You've, uh, you've not asked me about Marcy. Marcy? Sure. How is she? She's fine. She's good. She's real good. Well, that's good. Uh, that's great. You know, I tell her I say hi. <laughs> I will. I'll tell her. I'll say I bumped into Tony and he said to say hi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You tell her. <laughs> tell her I was asking after. <laughs> I will. And Kate? Kate? Yeah. Kate? Uh, Kate's been gone a long time. Sorry. I've been a long time ago. So it's just you? Yep. And that's okay? Yep. That's how I like it. Yeah. Marcy will be sad to hear it. Yeah, but then what? About Kate? Kate's fine, she left, that's all. Oh, sorry, I, I thought I thought when you said it, you said Kate's gone. Kate's, I fine. Kate's fine, she moved back to the old neighborhood. She did? Fucking Kate's all right, right? Kate's fine. <laughs> Marcy, you <laughs> can please Just take, just, just, just tell, tell Marcy Kate's okay, she's fine. She's doing fine. I will. She, uh, she with anybody? I will know. Like I said, I don't get into the old neighborhood anymore. Yeah, you said. Yeah, I just keep myself to myself these days. Yeah, not yeah. like the old days then. <laughs> I don't think about the old days. Yeah, why would you? I mean, those days are long gone. Uh, long gone. They're well behind me now. That's right. 
So, what you want to these days? <laughs> Me? Getting by. You got a couple of things on the go. Nothing big, nothing too ambitious. What about you? I keep myself pretty busy. Always something to do. And, uh, and then there's Marcy, of course. <coughs> of course. Well, as you'll appreciate, Marcy keeps me pretty busy. Well, yeah. <laughs> she still requires a lot of, uh, I appreciate it. Yeah, did you know that? Yeah, yeah, as I said, I'm aware. Yeah, you would be aware. Why wouldn't you be aware? Yeah, you know, of all people. Like I, like I said, you know, I, I really don't want to get into all of this. Don't want to get into what? Don't want to get into all of that. Oh, that, that business? That business between me and you and Marcy? That business between me and you. I'd rather not get into it right now. Rather not get into what? Like I said. <laughs> ah, you said. <coughs> so that's it? No more to be said on the subject. Nothing more to be said. There's quite a lot to be said about it from where I'm standing. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing more to be said. It hasn't already been said before. You tried telling that to Marcy, huh? I thought you said Marcy was fine. She is fine, considering. Considering what? Considering she's only got half a face. Yeah, and I should know that. You should know that. You should. And you should know that I pay for that. You pay for that? I pay for you that. Did you pay for that? You know I pay for that. You more than you would think. How do you know what I think? Ah, oh, God! Why are you bringing this up? You wanted to know how much he was. I told you she was fine. You think you'd be fine with half your face shot away, huh? Uh, if you remember, Louis. Oh, I remember. If you remember, I was aiming at you. Oh, that's right, John. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> you were uh, you were aiming at me, and Mercy, she got in the way. Uh, 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 all this happened a long time ago, Louis. Maybe you've forgotten why actually happened. Yeah? I haven't forgotten anything. I lost everything in that fire, Louis. Everything. All I had, everything I owned up in smoke. Yeah, sure you did. But you still believe, don't you? You still believe to this day that I set that fire? I know who set the fire, Louis! I told you before, I'm telling you again, Tony. I didn't set that fire. That was as much my business as it was yours. Franny died in the fire, yeah, Louis! Yeah, Franny died in that fire. You know how come Franny died in that fire? Oh, God, all of this has been said before. You know how come Franny died in that fire? Oh, uh, I know what you're going to say, Louis. I'm oh, sure you do, yeah. So when are you going to accept it, huh? When are you going to accept that you were wrong. Oh, God. Why you come all this way for this? What do you mean, come all this way? You come all this way just to tell me I was wrong. I didn't come here for this. All right, so why, where is this? Just some sort of coincidence. I come here the same reason you come here. All right, yeah, so Marcy knows you come here. Of course. I don't keep nothing from Marcy. She knows everything. I'll be telling her, I'll say, I bumped into Tony, and he says to say hi. I'll say, oh, you remember Tony? Oh, of course you remember Tony. He's the guy who shot you in the face. You've got to pump to all this, Louis. Because if you have, spit it out. We've been over this a hundred times, huh? Let's just move on. Just giving you something to think about, Tony. I spent four years in the camp thinking about it. I spent another three years getting my life back together. Yeah, pity Marcy can't put her face back together. Eh? What do you want from me, Louis? Nothing. I don't want nothing from you, Tony. Nothing. Oh, that's just great. Let's move on. Let's put it behind us. Yeah, happy to. Hmm. Hey, Marcy. We, uh... We got a good thing going on now. We got a life to lead. Ain't no use in dwelling on what's past. Huh? Oh, really? Huh. I guess I would not have guessed. <laughs> <laughs> it's a shame Franny, uh... Ain't got no life to leave, right? Franny, you ever think about that, will you? you? ever think about Franny? Franny set the fire, Tony. He was mixed up with some pretty heavy-duty guys back then. Heavy-duty guys? You have no idea. Oh, I know what you think, but I know a little different, all right, Louie? Now, let's just leave it like that. Ain't got time for all this shit. I gotta get to work. She forgives you? What? Marcy, she forgives you. I just wanted you to know that. Well, that's just great, Louis. That's just great. Yeah, and uh, what about you? You must be forgiving you. Forgiving me? What's she got to forgive me for? Oh, 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 oh. Hey, you never told her. Told her what? Huh. What you getting at, Tony? So, uh, what well, you never told her about? Franny. Franny? Huh. Sure she knew about Franny. Everyone knew about Franny. I'm not talking about the fire, Louis. Oh, you're not talking about the fire? Then what you talking about, Tony? I'm huh? talking about you. I'm talking about you and Franny. Me and Franny? Ah, you saying I put him up to it? Is that it? Because you know I didn't set that fire, Tony. You know exactly where I was that evening. And you know I didn't set that fire, so what? You saying I put him up to it? Is that it? You know what I'm talking about, Louie? Ah, oh, God. 
Franny was my best friend. How do you think I wouldn't know? Know what? Oh, give it a rest, Louie! I'm sick and tired of all of this. We've all hurt somebody. We've done some things we wish we hadn't. Let's just move on. You tried to kill me, Tony. Your own brother. You tried to kill me. Of course I tried to kill you! Why wouldn't I? Look what you did to me, Louis. You, you burned down my business. You stole my wife. You killed my best friend, Louis. My best friend! Of course I tried to kill you, my own brother! Ah, oh, God! You know, Louis, I wish the fuck it was you I shot that night instead of shooting Marcy. Marcy. Shooting my own wife. You weren't even with Marcy back then. You were with Kate. That makes a difference. It made a difference to Marcy. Why? So if we were still together, then Marcy would have just stood by and let me shoot you. We were still together. If you went off cheating with Kate, then me and Marcy, you know, we would have jumped in bed together. Who else was she going to turn to? Jesus! I'm so sick of this. You think we're not hurting? You think we're not hurting because of you? Hurting? Why should you be hurting? Huh? Everything's turned out on the door for you, Louis. Huh? You do the cry. I do the time. Get rid of me. Get rid of Franny. Don't you look so innocent. I know everything about you and Franny. You take over my business, you take my wife. What the fuck do you want from me, Louis? I want you to say you were sorry. What? I want you to say you were sorry. To admit you were wrong. You were wrong about the fire. You were wrong about Franny. You say he was your best friend. You don't know the first thing about him. What the fuck are you Franny talking about? Franny said the fire to get rid of the evidence, and that's the truth, Tommy. That is the truth. Even Kate, even Kate, Kate knew the truth. What the fuck Kate is Kate got to do with this? Kate knew everything. Don't tell me. What are you fucking on about? It's only you. It's only you. It's only you who's been so blind. And you know what? Another thing. You want to know the truth about me and Marcy? I uh, I want to break my voice. Now we can come to a fucking way to break my voice. You now, listen to yourself, but after all this time, and this really sticks in my craw, after all this time, you never once said you were sorry. <coughs> not to me, not to Marcy, you tried to kill me, Tony. Your own brother and me did you any harm. Bullshit, Louis, bullshit. Yeah, okay, that's it. I said my piece, that's it. Mm. Oh, what, that's <laughs> it? That's <laughs> it. <laughs> well, that, that, so everything's just happy and dandy now, we can just move on? Yeah. There's nothing more to be said. It's like you said, it's water under the bridge, huh? Mm. You got some nerve, Louis. I'm quite a big shot, eh, Tony? Always were a pompous prick. Still can't face reality. Oh, I should have left you in those stinking kitchens with some pots and cutting up fresh. Always the big shot, always the tough guy. Yeah, the snake in the grass, you turn that to Cut down the sides. You backstab yourself. That bastard, Tony. I pity you. Little bit of advice, Louis. Stay out of my face. If I get this, hmm? Best you don't come here anymore. Nah, me come here. Maybe it's best you don't come here no more, huh? I've been coming here a long time, Louis. I come here, I come here any goddamn time of my life, and there ain't a goddamn thing you can do about it. I don't want, want any trouble here, Louis. You get no trouble from me, they know what you do they? No, what? They just think they should know. No, what, Louis? What are you talking about? They have a right to know you said they don't want no trouble, do they? Oh, God, right, I get it. Yeah, you want to screw this up for me? Like you screwed everything else up in my life. Is that what you're talking about, Louis? Huh? Huh? You gotta screw up, Tony, not me. Screw you. I screw you too, Tony. Oh, you know, and another thing. Oh, what? I should have said it earlier, but I uh, I promised some guys, like, I, I saw oh, some guys, Louis. You know, that you'll be my brother and all. If I should bump into you. What guys, um, Louis? Some guys from the old neighborhood, but if I should bump into you, I should pass something on to you, and I said I'd be happy to pass on the message. What yeah. message, Louis? Sorry, Tommy. You knew this was coming. 